Hey guys, I'm back with a new video. In this video, let us discuss about booleans in JavaScript. Now, boolean is like a switch. At any point of time, it is in one of the two possible configurations. Either it is on or off, to the or falsy. Now, we use booleans for logic such as the if statement. They can be manually set or can be calculated. Now, let us define some demo code to understand this. So, let me define a variable called as subscribers count. I set that to 3000. Now I want to know that a particular channel for which the subscribers count is given to us, whether it is popular or not. So I will say const is popular. Now if the subscribers count, which is a variable, is greater than 2500, the channel should be popular. So let us try logging is popular to the console. So let me try running this by saying node booleans.js. So if I run the file, we are getting is popular true. Now in this video, we'll focus on equal signs, double equal to, and triple equal sign as well. Now the first one, which is a single equal to, is just for setting a value to a variable. As you can see, we are using a single equal to sign for setting a value of 3000 to the variable subscribers count. Okay, now before we get into the difference between double equal to and triple equal to, we should always use triple equal to and double equal to is always a bad practice. So I will say always prefer triple equal to over double equal to. Using double equal to is always generally a bad practice. Okay, do take a note of this. Now, moving on, uh, let me try to uh, do the triple equal to comparison. So if I log to the console subscribers count and I say triple equal to 3000. So what do you expect to get? Okay, so uh, a little introduction to triple equal to. Now this triple equal to sign what it does is it compares the value and the type of both the operand that you are trying to compare. So on the left side, we have the subscribers count and on the right side, we have a value. And both the types are same. So subscribers count is also a number. This is also a number and the value. And the type is also same and the value is also same. So this should return us true. And yes, we are getting a true for this. Now, let us do one more thing now. Now, if I say console.log, console.log to triple equal to two. So both are numbers. The type is number, the value is also same. And hence, this should also give us two. So we are getting a two for this as well. Now, now this triple equal to, let us make a note here triple equal to is used for strict equality comparison. We are checking for both the type and the value. Of the things that we are comparing. Okay. And for double equal to, I will say, it is used for lose equality comparison. So we are concerned only with the value, uh, only with the value and not with the types. Okay, we are only concerned with the value. So let me show you what I mean by this. Okay, so now if I try to log two double equal to two. Now in this case, it doesn't matter because both the operands that we are trying to compare uh, is definitely numbers and the value is also same. So we will definitely get a true as well for this as well. Now, uh, to conclude from these points that we covered, if both are uh, giving us the same output, like here, both the statements, both the logs are giving us the same output, 
Now, what is the difference between these? The main difference is that the triple equal to, as I told you, we are checking for both the value and the type of both the things that we are comparing. And it is also known as the strict equality comparison. OK. And in case of double equal to, it does not check for the types. We are only concerned with the value. OK. So if I say now, I say I compare console log a two within single quotes and two. What do you expect to get for this? So I will run the file and say node booleans.chase and you can see we are getting true for this. Why so? Because we are only comparing the values. We are not concerned about the types here. The types are definitely different. This is a string. This is a number. But the values are same and hence we are getting true if we do lose, compa uh, lose equality comparison in this case. Okay. But if I say console log to within single quotes and then triple equal to two. Now this will do strict equality comparison and we definitely want that the types for both the operands should be same. But which is not the case here and here we will get false. So we are definitely getting false here. Now, now this is all about uh, the video on data types, what I wanted to cover on data types. So as we understand all about loose equality comparison, uh, the strict equality comparison, these things are very important to take away for further lessons. So this was all about data types. In the very next video, we will start with functions and then build up from there. So if you're loving the content, don't forget to share the video with your friends and colleagues and do subscribe to the channel.